guys, it's me again, and back with my YouTube video. Today, I'm going to be telling you guys my seventh grade reflection. Um, I promised this video. Also, eating some peaches, so I might take like a little break to eat them, like right now. They never get old. <laughs> One announcement. So I'm going to be posting regular videos like this, like sit down, reaction videos, stuff like that, on Tuesdays and Wednesdays. I repeat, Tuesdays and Wednesdays. But as you guys know, if you watch the series, um, I post the Walking the Telltale series. I post gaming videos. Those will be on Thursdays only. So Tuesday and Wednesday, regular videos. Thursdays, gaming videos. Um, but anyways, let's get right into the video. So... I immediately have to say this year had, had to probably be the hardest, not only because I wasn't used to some of the stuff that I was learning, but we were online. <laughs> some people went inside of school for the last month, which I didn't really get why, but others, we stayed at home. It was really hard to stay at home. I really wanted to go to school, but I was like, it's not really worth the risk of getting COVID. I really, I really struggled with math this year because... You know, some of the other um, subjects like science, like we learn new stuff every single year for science. History, we learn new stuff, but it's, it's kind of easy. ELA, we just read passages and annotate. But math, it was different because I learned different stuff like percents. I can't really think of anything else at the top of my head, but I really struggled with math. Um, it, just, it was just really hard to really grasp the material without being in person and having someone to guide me or someone to help me with work also it was i feel like it was very hard for not only students but for teachers too because i'm not gonna call out anyone but <laughs> there were some people that just really never stopped unmuting themselves and it was very hard for teachers to teach when the same people were muting themselves to talk about gooberish nonsense so i feel like the teachers had the highest frustration level of everyone but since i'm going to eighth grade and massachusetts they're opening up schools fully for next school year um i definitely want to pay attention a lot because i want to keep my grades good for whatever high school that I go to. I'm really debating on two high schools. Um, but I really have to sign up like in December, <laughs> but I wanna keep my grades good so I can have a higher chance in getting into either a high school, whichever one I get into. Um, but I definitely need to stay focused. I can't let things get in the way. Oh, and also, <laughs> also, <laughs> I can't, like I need, a, I need to learn how to say no sometimes. I feel like, I'm like the study guide for some people, like if that makes sense. I just need to learn how to say no sometimes. Like I will, I'm ha I'm happy to help you sometimes, but if I'm like doing something, I need to learn how to say no because, say if I have an appointment, <laughs> I need to say no sometimes. So it's just like really hard to say no because I don't I don't want to be rude or I don't want to hurt anyone's feelings. It's just like I can't do it today. <laughs> also, I remember my sister she's talking she was talking about like slope inside of eighth grade can someone please tell me what slope is because she was always complaining about it can someone please tell me, like could someone type in the comments if you're like in eighth grade or higher what slope is because i really can't comprehend it like i don't understand i feel like i really would have stayed back if it wasn't for quizlet <laughs> especially in math so i just want to say thank you quizlet for helping me you know stay on track and helping me um you know not stay back i feel like it was also just me like trying to pay attention i feel like i didn't pay attention at the beginning of most quarters but when it started to get to the end of the in each quarter and i had like a c plus in one class it just really like motivated me to start like paying attention more <laughs> for the last two weeks to get my grades up to a b or even to an a um i'm actually proud of myself this year because this year had to be the hardest one and I got all honors this was like the first year the first entire school year i got all honors last school year i got all honors but except for like the last quarter i got like two c's and two b's but i'm actually really really proud of myself because this was a very very hard year um mentally 
and physically so I'm, I'm i'm just proud of myself if you guys enjoy this video i know it's really short but there's not that much i can really talk about in seventh grade i'm just really happy that's done and over with so i don't have to deal with some of the annoying teachers i had this year again um hope you guys enjoy this video with luck leave a comment subscribe and turn post notifications so you know when i post i'll see you guys in the next video peace out